To remove the seat padding from Akiko NextFit, start by raising the headrest. Then unbuckle and loosen the harness. Remove the newborn insert if it's installed. Next, unsnap the headrest on both sides and pull up on the fabric to reveal two hooked elastic strings. Unhook both of the strings. Then pull the headrest fabric forward to remove. Unsnap the seat bottom panel and pull it forward. Then pull the seat padding away from the harness release button. Unhook the Velcro strap and pull on the pad, sliding the Velcro out through the slot. Repeat on the opposite side. Now, carefully pull the seat padding away from the child restraint. To reinstall the padding, repeat the process in reverse, starting by placing the pad over the seat back. Tuck the back panel around the tether strap. Open the latch storage doors and slide the Velcro strap through the appropriate slot. With the seat pad aligned in the outer panels, pull on the Velcro strap while pushing the seat padding into the seat contour. Repeat on the opposite side. Tuck the front edge of the seat pad under and around the bottom edge of the seat. Tuck the seat pad around the harness adjustment cover by working it in under one corner and moving your way around. Feed the crotch buckle back through the seat pad and wrap the harness around the seat pad. Resnap the seat bottom panel. To reinstall the headrest pad, place the pad over the headrest. Tuck the edge of the pad behind the outer panel and pull the elastic strap around the back of the headrest. Hook the elastic and attach the two snaps at the headrest button. Guide the harness around the back panel and add the infant insert if in use. Adjust the headrest to the proper position. Once it's reassembled, double check the orientation of the shoulder pads, chest clip, and buckle tongues. Make sure the harness straps are flat and not twisted when buckled, and check that the buckle is inserted correctly through the cutout in the seat bottom panel.